The Aster 30 NT missile is comprised of the booster and the terminal dart. The booster is very large and thus has a lot of fuel and accelerates the missile to very high speed, giving it most of its thrust in range. The booster uses thrust vectoring to effectively maneuver the missile. The terminal dart has a smaller cruise rocket motor, which propels it after separation. It uses another motor to supply energy for the lateral thrusters that allow precise corrections required for a hit-to-kill intercept. The lateral thrust system is comprised of a rocket motor, ducts, shutters, and four nozzles that are embedded into the wings to avoid interrupting the airflow considerably. The rocket motor burns and creates gases that go through the ducts and are then stopped by the shutters. When lateral thrust is needed, a corresponding shutter is rotated, allowing the gases to escape from the corresponding nozzle, thus applying thrust in the desired direction. The terminal dart also has a set of large tail fins. Combined with the thrusters and its low weight, they make it very agile. In addition to that, the missile has an active radar seeker operating in the KB band. The seeker has a long range and high angular accuracy. Although Aster may be a hit to kill interceptor, it has a small directed blast fragmentation warhead to ensure threat destruction. These capabilities make the Aster 30NT one of the most formidable missile systems deployed on ships.